Welcome back to the channel. This is part four of our Lego Fortnite series, the renovation arc. In this episode, we do an overhaul of our first village and you can see the life just oozing out of it. If you're new here or returning, kiss that like button. And if you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and do that right now. Less than 10% of you who watch our videos are subscribed. So help us reach 200 subs before the summer comes around. Don't forget to join our Discord server and follow us on the kick down below. With all that out of the way, we hope you enjoy. Now let's get on with this spectacular video. Gotta start building for renovation arc. Renovate all of the lands. That's our name in them. I, there's names for them, but I'm forgetting what the names are. Snow Village, the Winter Wonderland Village, not gotten a name. I'm on my way to the Grasslands Village right now. The original village, we named it the Feline Fortress. We got to renovate that first. That's that's first mission to renovate. Night Fort, we called their, our desert. That's step two of the renovation. We're back, yo. Right now, I know I need like a whole bunch of vines. Copper, all of it. All the vines. And then I also need... Five stacks. Five stacks of regular armor. Armor. It's a bit of a problem. Problem is, need way too much bright. Well, I guess the actual problem, I don't have any bright. So I'm gonna go grab some. We gotta go all the way to night four in the desert. Hopefully there's some in the chest, and if there isn't, we're gonna have to get the cave. Put away the things I don't need right now. I believe it's around this mountain. bright core and then i like went to the regular desert and like searched the cave and found some and then i was like wait i was to go to like the brand new caves i want every piece of bright core every piece of bright core you could find in this seed we finally made it to the far land caves so let's find us some gosh darn bright core Now that we have 420 bright core, we can head on back. They're not the bad, huh? And it's anything. Be that serious. All right, we finally filled up this chest, gathered all the materials. I'm gonna need to actually renovate this shit. I think this would be good though. Four of everything about. <laughs> right, good job, buddy. Glass. This just gave me glass made from glass. sand. <laughs> There's a purple fishing rod. I can make it right now. Bro, I have a fishing rod. A basic compass. So, oh. Bro, they, read, they literally read my mind, bro. It's just like a, like the numbers up top. I'm gonna go fish a little bit. I'm gonna go look at some look at some fishies. What you got for me, gang? Yeah. <gasps> Bait bucket? Good looks, brother. Throw this into water to attract fish. Thanks, bro. Uh, uh. Oh, I have to hold it. Okay, okay. Oh, I got something. A blue slurp fish. Reading, uh... Whoa, a new fish. Blue small fry. Can't even carry it. Oh shit, cool. All right, let's go back to building, guys. Let me dump some of this blue shit away. A whole bunch of fishes. I basically got a good amount of what I think I need. Yeah, let's just get started decorating. Let's start with lighting. It's just finally coming down. I 
put the map marker right. We're gonna put the map marker up in this in this tower. Cool. Now let's decorate this. Trying to cook up, you know what I'm saying? I'm realizing I haven't fucking yapped a word in a minute, but I'm cooking, bro. I'm cooking. I think that spot is good. We're not done with this building. No. I still can't stack books on top of each other, alright. Leave it like this. I kind of like this. It's supposed to be Meowsko's house. I don't know why I can't set his bed. The thing that I want to build, I want to build one of these. See, I want this right here, something like this. So I need iron, more iron for that. And I also want like the bottles or something here, which I need rough amber for. Obsidian, rough amber, I need to go on an adventure for, and you'll get some more materials. I need iron and rough amber, which I have none of. So we are going to go to the snow village. Hopefully, there's those things are there, then we don't have to gather too much. But then I also still want to go beyond, go to the farther deserts again, do some gathering. We'll see what happens. And I believe I need not root wood as well. We're getting a little update on the on Snow Village as we come by and as Josiah builds it in the background. He had the little barrier to fix the villager stuck underneath problem, I believe. Added some stairs for them to walk up as well. Nice, nice. Yep, look at that, look at that. See, it's working, I see him. Good job, fish sticks. No, this is tough. Shim regular, shim regular. Nice. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need this. Oh, look at Color Team Leader just fucking being a savage. Good job, Color Team Leader. I like, I like the superpowers. Can you teach me? That shit is heat. What are you doing? How are you doing that? So what is it that I need? I need regular iron and an obsidian. And we're back to the feline fortress. There you go, the farm. Looking cool. And I've decorated this background, this back area. This looks pretty far. Looks like something I didn't build. I'm not 100% sure what this even supposed to be, but you know what I'm saying? Just for somebody to sit here, watch the farm, you know what I'm saying? So, anyways, finally, we are back with the goods. All the extra things the rough amber, some extra obsidian, not root wood, and flex wood. This is supposed to be Meow School's crib, but I can't assign his fucking bed for some stupid reason. And what I wanted to give him was a little bottle. Some Yasuo's gets down like that, and then, and then, you know, the blade, because he's just a savage. And he's gonna have some painting up there for no reason. That's Gucci for his house, you know what I'm saying? He got some books, he got a little shelf. He be writing, he got a scroll with some more uh, spoons and things, books and water. Yeah, he be chilling. Let's suit up and boot up this shit right here. Put some light on all the sides. Get some outside things taken care of. Nice. Now I like that. I fuck with that. I just want to be flush with that. Damn. Cool. Yeah, it has to be flush the door. And it. Made my own little flower beds. Chill. Both of them is also coming with me. And even the essence table as well. No! While we're here, we might as well just... 
this we'll just let uh grow as time goes on or is that cheapskate moves i am gonna spend the smackaroons to finish this chest room i need one two three four five six more chests I can sit down. That's so cool. Can I sit down and like other other things? Then? Yeah, I can. That's so fucking heat. How about this, bro? We can sit down now. That's so fucking fire. Yeah, that's not going there. Nice. We got a little fridge. Oh, I can't put stuff on a fridge. That's not fucking cool. I think that's good enough. Yeah, I just want carpets in here eventually once I get enough. MTV Cribs for real, bro. Tabby's bed. Give Tabby your own little, you know what I'm saying, own little area. I forgot there's a whole like a uh, little public bathroom in the in the village. I'll just put a carpet there and then I think that'd be it. Chill, 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 chill. Hold up, hold up. I'm trying to figure out like a way to make this cooler in some way, but I don't know man. I don't think there's much more I can do to make this look any more cooler. Their spot is definitely uh, suited up. I like that. The crate of wood makes sense. I don't know why. That looks cool back there. Feels right. Oh, shit. I can put that on top of that. Okay, cool. Let's put that one. I hate that I can't really, like, see too well sometimes. We got to figure out how to make this. I need some, like, texture. You know what I'm saying? I need some, like... Layers, yeah, like that. An angle, bam. Barrels like that, you dig? No. I put it there, we gonna leave it there. I wish I could hang stuff on the ceiling, but I can't. Boy, fake. Why can't that one go higher? Maybe I don't have that shit hanging, that, that light, that industrial ass light. I mean, there's nothing else I could really hang there right? other than the candle and it takes too much space. It ee woody dee, brother. I gotta fill it up, bro. That's where this shit just makes it look amazing now. Boom, look at that. Boom. There we are. Boom. Offsetting it. Boom. All right. Yeah. This is good. Downstairs. Do you think the, the villagers go and get wool? Because I need that for carpet. I'm just gonna put it all the way at the end when I'm like done, because that shit's mad expensive. Low key, this is about to be done. I'm about to just do the outside. Like finish how many plots of farm I want, I guess. Like the back area and the side. And then move on to uh, like our house. I need a shovel. Where's my shovel at? I had a blue shovel. Oh, I got it on me. How many stacks do I have? I have, all right. I have way too much dirt. Yeah. <laughs> so, put a little light up here. Add some fucking little pillars here, grid. I'm not sure what to do back here. I'm not sure there is anything to do back here. Yeah, this should over here about to be the training spot in a second. Okay, okay, bro. All right, cool. Right, let's just try these because these are wrong. That looks right. That looks about right. I guess we just get on with this, eh? 
First thing is this. Well, there's no need for a back door on this thing. So we're just gonna we're just gonna remove now to see if I can fix any of it. I can fix this. Add a little uh, make the front look pretty. Alright, the front. Need to finish the outside here. I wanna make this look like a like where the grill where the grill would be at. Instead, there you go. Cool. Start here with a go. Wait. Great. Lego. All right. I think before I head inside, I make the training area. So first, that's funny. When you hit the train dummy, that your sword doesn't do shit. It's what the fuck? What the fuck is the point? All right. Well, we ran out of regular wood. No regular wood. Let's get some. You know what they're doing. They only let Holy allow you to find it. Oh yeah, I have some mad shit. Desert. Ah, they're taking yourself, bro. Do I put a railing around this whole thing, bro? I do like the railing. Railing is gonna happen, brother. That I get I the yeah, I know this. Yeah, yeah I, uh, she said I don't know. Hey guys, it's a bro. Oh my god. I actually made it. It's been so long since I've seen this place. Oh you're back. Hi, how are you? This is what I need right here. The flex. I like this. Go back to the railing. All right, railing done. Nice. So I'm gonna have a back little weird pool storage area. I'm a um says me for this. This made a little bit of a, sh a shrine back here. Alright, well this yeah. is pretty random but I like it. I know you don't understand this shit, but um here. Grab all this. Just know you're now like one of the best players in this game. I just watched the drug deal. All right, now I go inside. Everything, bro. Yeah. Let me ask you, get the fuck out the way. Oh my, bro, what the fuck? Oh, this. All right, bathroom mm, complete. It should be. They're like, yeah, we got him. Very hard. Uh, see, it's high little the new world is roll over three dag. Yeah, I'ma just do our best. I shag. Oh fuck. No. I don't know why. I think the bottom floor is pretty good for now. I think this is good. I think I finished our crib, bro. This crib is tough, bro. I'm fucking with it, OD now. Little like 
little training area in the back with a little shrine. They cooking shit on the side of the building. Ah, we decorate the middle. Chairs. Cool. I think that's basically it. I just need to do the carpet thing. That's actually crazy. Yeah, I'm finally finished with the feline fortress renovation. So let's uh let's give y'all a tour, eh? We added some lights in the front to guide you into the gates. We lost a wall that was here. Center of the village, we got a a well. A well with some hanging out areas, little iron bars on the table, seating areas, benches. From there, let's go to the to the villagers facilities. This is the public bathroom for my villagers. Got a book in a sink and a toilet and a bathtub, you know what I'm saying? A little, little painting and a decorations. This house is Peely's and who, who else lives here? Peely and Hayseed's house. This is Peely and Hayseed's house. They got a, we got some beverages, a nice little kitchen. They're living good, they're living good. You know what I'm saying? They got lights, they got electricity, some plants. So I think they're good. They got a little bucket of water. But now this is Silas's house. In Silas's house, I gave him a little upgrade, nothing too crazy in here, nothing crazy that much. Gave him a little lamp. My brother's house, ruler of soccer, Dante. He was in his world for like five minutes, made a bed. You know, might as well have souped up his crib, you know what I'm saying? Gave him a little toilet. Now for the storage house, let's start outside. You know, we had the little decorations on the outside, grew the plot of land. Yeah, you know, inside the storage house, we had to fill the storage room up with grand chests, you know? They're all empty. Well, not all of them are empty, but a whole bunch of empty chests for now. But we have space. We have endless space. That's what matters. We added a fridge full of slurp juices. Since we have so much, might as well. Um, carpet, of course. All the workshops, because this is the, you know, storage workshop house. Upstairs, we got some more workshop. Some materials up here. Some, some decoration. Over here, you know, we have the essence table all suited up, booted up, looking nice some statues to protect it and in this corner we have tabby's little room and tabby's little area should be chilling you know a little a little farm area back here with some more um barrels and crates for decoration a little seating area to hang out just look at the look at the farm i also decorated the watchtower i completely redesigned this bottom area gave it another little seating area to sit and watch the farm you know, a little better view. You can see a lot more of the farm. My favorite part, favorite renovation of the Feline Fortress is the little training dojo that was created, inspired by the Snow Village. We must train all of our villages, so, you know, this will be, this is what we got going on. And bills over here for weapon making, more of the grindstone also for weapon making. Then we have a little grill area out here on the right side of the house. Nothing fancy, just, you know, coming out the grill. We got the wood, you know what I'm saying? A little more decorations. Now, if you go inside the house, we walk inside the house. We got a little dining room area, a little kitchen, the oven, the carpets, and decorations everywhere. There's no functions to any of this stuff, you know? It's all just to look cool. But then we have our own bathroom. You dig, you dig, you dig. And then as we go upstairs, we got a little scene area for, you know, when me and Josiah plan out our master plans. Yeah, we just come up here and get fucking sauced up on the Lego scissor, you know what I'm saying? Upstairs is like the living quarters. We come around this end. It's the living quarters for me and Josiah. You know, this is my bed, size, size bed. Yeah, it's a little size area. He basically lives mainly in the snow village. The snow village is his empire, so it's cool, you know? Outside of the village, I moved the watchtower that was outside right there to up on this hill. I thought it would look better. This chest right here is for part five. Stay tuned for what I use these materials for. I redesigned the top part of this watchtower. As you can see from that one over there is what it originally looks like. I destroyed the walls, added a statue, you know, made this more of a archer tower. Someone people can actually watch over, you know? And for the last thing on the tour is the launch pad. I moved and added some safety 
to the stairs going up. And since Feline Fortress is renovated, we move to stage two, which is renovating Night Fort over in the desert. Thank you guys for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and comment what part of the village you think looks the best. As always, we appreciate all of your support and we'll see you next week.